Hey guys, welcome to Mishi Blue Tarot. Uh, welcome to my channel. This is Neelam, and I am back for all of you with another reading today. So, this reading is going to be that specific question, which is very interesting, and we've done that in our channel before. So, this is going to be about what's happening for you behind the scenes. Like, this is something that probably, for example, if there's something happening in your life and you don't know. Why is it happening? What could be the purpose behind it? So here we are. We'll try to see. So, how, I mean, while you're picking your pile, I would want you guys to think about that situation. And if there is no situation, then you can just zero down and go blank and pick up a pile. But if there is a situation and you are like a little lost about it in terms of, you know, understanding why did this happen in your life or why or what is it that is you know, the purpose behind this thing, then this is your reading. You have to think about that situation and then pick your piles. So I'll take you through the choices. Pile one is the angelite crystal. Point pile two is uh, the amethyst pyramid. Pile three is the green aventurine pyramid. Okay. So you can pause the video, um, look at all the three piles, look at all the three options and go ahead and pick your piles. I'll pause for two seconds. All right, so we'll begin with pile one. Just give me a second. All right, so here we are. Pile number one. Let's see what's happening for you behind the scenes. This is for the angelite pile. Okay, so I've picked two oracle cards and I'll be looking deeper into it with the help of tarot cards as well. So let's see what are these two cards. The angel gate, cleansing, protection and blessing. Honor the lineage. Okay, interesting. So pile one, I am seeing uh, that you are up to something, like you're doing a lot of things at this point could be, okay? And it's a divine calling from inside. So don't take it lightly. I mean, don't think that you're doing something small. You're really doing something big. It is like setting up your empire of sorts, okay? Um, so you've traveled a certain path and now you finally reach that position where your gate or the place that you're supposed to be, you are nearing that place, all right? You're getting closer and closer, okay? In this process or in this path, you might have gone through a lot of changes in terms of cleansing, okay, in terms of purging, in terms of getting rid of certain karmic patterns in your life. You have gone through that whole situation, step by step, one by one, okay. So I see that you're finally getting to that point, you're finally getting to that place where you're meant to be, okay? This could be, for a lot of you, this could be to do with your career path, okay? Um, I'm also seeing that right now, okay, um, this thing or this place that, or whatever you're calling is, runs in your bloodline somewhere. Like maybe, for example, if you're a psychic, okay, or if you are an empath, or if you are someone who's, uh, who is into the spiritual world, as in the spiritual business for that matter, or somebody who is, may, for example, if you're a dancer, <laughs> that's the b first thing that I pick up. If dance comes in you naturally, if singing comes in you naturally, if planting trees comes in you naturally, if greenery attracts you naturally, it's there in your bloodline. 
there is something that you need to make out of it or do out of it okay now i'm also seeing this thing that the closer you get it might become a little difficult for you in terms of managing everything that difficulty you might face here this i can see so that situation will come in where you might feel that how do i balance everything okay what's happening for you behind the scenes is this gate opening up for you but yes it is not going to be very very easy for you to reach there you've already walked a certain till a certain point till a path or whatever like till a certain point i would say you walked till there and that journey itself hasn't been very easy for you okay and you know that already so it's full of a lot of things okay um but you are like literally getting to the place you're meant to be like you're getting to the destination okay let's see what else is happening for you behind the scenes I see a lot of you gaining recognition within the next 2 years. A lot of recognition. It's like finally the clouds moving away and the sun shining bright on you. You were like really imbibing in the energy of the sun. And it's taking you places. what's happening for you behind the scenes the emperor two of wands and the judgment there is a person coming in your life very soon something that you always waited for and i'm seeing that this person as you near your life path or as you keep moving towards the direction of your journey the more closer this person is going to come to you I see that okay for some of you just a message i pick up that you are into dancing or something very creative that this person is very attracted towards i see a person here and the more closer you are to that or to that spirit of yours of you know doing what you're meant to do the closer you get to that the closer this person comes to you okay the more and more you be that way or the more and more you focus there the more this person gets awakened to uh their feelings for you now i'm seeing that maybe you are in some sort of a twin flame connection or a very deep soulmate connection where your life paths are linked somewhere and that's the reason why it just ignites both of you when both of you are doing well in your dynamics okay so i am seeing this person i did tell you within 2 years within 2 years a lot of things will transform and change here in your life and behind the scenes this is what the universe is bringing for you what you're meant to do and who you're meant to be with all of this is coming to you okay and i'm actually seeing that uh, you would be taken by surprise really why because this is not something that you ex expected at all this is not something that you expected so it's coming um in a way that you probably would be taken aback like fully taken aback that sort all right let's see what else is happening for you behind the scenes pile 1 
this person will also be very protective towards you and if you think that they will not support your purpose then you're wrong this person is very supportive in fact this person is here in your life to help you achieve more behind the scenes What's happening behind the scenes? So I have eight of coins, which is the eight of pentacles, six of swords, chariot. Wow. Interesting spread. Ten of wands. So behind the scenes, the universe is taking away a certain kind of a burden that you had been feeling in your life. That burden is going away from you slowly. And the point is you will have to make a choice also to go away from it and then the universe will facilitate it. Okay, uh, a work is happening behind the scenes so that you your movement becomes easier. All right. Um, I can see that there is a situation which is very troublesome for you. There is a situation which can be very very burdensome for you and it's not something that gives you happiness so here the universe is working on liberating you from it yes 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 wow beautiful cards i have so i have the two of cups the temperance and the seven of swords so this is actually behind the scenes the universe working for you this is what i'm getting the universe working for you to bring in the best for you, for your love life, for your career, everything. So what I pick from here is that you got to be focused on whatever you are doing right now. Just keep doing your thing because the more uh, you move towards your life purpose, the more closer you get to this person. I don't know if you already know this person. I'm picking up Aries. I'm picking up... Um, uh, Sagittarius, I'm picking up Cancer, I'm also picking up a, a bit of like a very strong Sag energy here. Anyways, it doesn't matter that much. But yeah, whoever this person is, like if this person behaves like an emperor, which I told you, rigid or very, very focused and like, you know, my way or the highway kind of a thing. So if you know this person, then you know that this is the person. But yes, this is somewhere that your life purposes are attached and um, behind the scenes, a work is happening for you to end a certain kind of a burden in your life, which is not giving you what you are, what you deserve. So it'll slowly get to that point. Okay. That's what I'm picking up. Now, let me just see one advice for you. What is the advice for file one? Three of Wands. Wow, Two of Cups. Wait, wait for this. Three of Cups. This is, your dreams will come true, Pile One. Your dream will come true. The vision, I think you're in a very, very strong energy of visualizing of what you truly want. So you are kind of sure who this person is. But again, learn to be happy. Stay happy. Stay in your happy element. And keep doing your thing. Keep doing what you're supposed to do. Because I see that if you keep doing that, you're moving in the direction of happiness, which is going to bring you stability. 
all right and behind the scenes all the problems are being taken care of so you don't have to worry there pile one okay all right pile one so that's what i have for you i hope this reading resonates uh private readings are open so you can reach out to me and uh i have two pages on instagram guys one is for tarot the other one is for crystals uh we're shipping only in india at the moment but i hope to start with international shipping very soon um please have a look the links are there in the description box and you can reach out to me for anything take care and bye okay so now let's move to pile number two which is the amethyst pyramid whoever chose this so let's see what's happening for you behind the scenes in this situation or in your life in general what can you expect okay so let's begin healing the earth love humility and respect and then we have be present okay behind the scenes pile 2 i'm seeing some sort of a spiritual awakening happening for you guys now when i say spiritual awakening i will keep it in very simple words um there is a certain sort of a wisdom that you have gained out of something okay and probably this wisdom has come with a lot of bitter experiences in your life and you are now accumulating those experiences for usage of others in some way or the other now this could be like um this could be like as in like maybe you are becoming a mentor or maybe you start talking to people you're basically in a lot of healing work okay uh maybe your voice is healing maybe the way you talk heals others or maybe it's just that you are in this situation okay don't look too much into the future right now at present this is what is happening for you this is what is happening for you and behind the scenes your future is being knit up for you this is your future path maybe if you are into if you're starting something new at present or if you're about to start something that is a uh, a business for that matter or a career path for that matter if you're about to start that then this is your path okay and this is what you're meant to be doing for the rest of your life i can see that your your wisdom is like to the power very strong right now as in intuitive abilities or your own way of dealing with things you have a mechanism which is really working in your favor so you don't have to worry about that all right I do sense that maybe if you are going I mean if you're starting something okay and if you're going through a tough time you're being asked to be patient here okay because one you can do it okay and don't lose faith because your future is being planned as per the kind of efforts you're putting right now so trust me you're moving in a very good direction in your life pile number 2 okay a very good direction where the universe is seeing your efforts so if your situation is becoming a little challenging okay because you have to focus on multiple things or if you have having to do multiple uh basically you're having to take care of a lot of things maybe a lot of things on your plate right now have patience okay don't lose patience cuz that will take you to some other level altogether and you have no idea how successful you will be all right i can see that if ever you feel uh, a little restless okay 
just meditate for some time but don't lose faith in your dreams because these dreams and that's what these dreams are building your behind the scenes by the way all right let's see what else is happening for you behind the scenes I'll take this, the Empress. So this is where you're heading. You are heading towards excellence. You are heading towards abundance in your life. Okay, you're making your dreams come true. What's happening for you behind the scenes? The lovers. Eight of Pentacles and the King of Cups. Okay, hang on. Okay, maybe this is a woman watching. If this is a woman watching, you are in a situation where there is somebody else also in the picture. All right, like maybe a situation where you're married to someone and that person is having a scene outside or maybe that person is not devoted to you. Like that's what you feel. All right. And you decided to work. You decided to do your thing. And that has made you very attractive. Now, this person suddenly feels love for you. This person suddenly feels the mistakes that they've made and they feel sorry and they want to fix things. Now, they don't want you to go. I also see that somewhere, somebody is jealous of you and your relationship. Somebody is doesn't have a very good eye on your relationship. Somebody is envious here. Okay, the energy of envy is quite strong. So you got to be careful there. Um, behind, this is happening behind your back. So you got to be a little careful, protect your energies, try to cleanse yourself every now and then, which is through crystal healing or if you want, you can like, you know, just keep your world to yourself. Okay. I am seeing that you are heading towards getting what you want. And people, there are some people, specifically one person, a woman who's not happy about you. Okay. This is a very general message as in like, this is a general reading. So I'm picking this up. If this is resonating, you would know. I see one lady of sorts who had doesn't have a very happy feeling for you okay let's see what else is happening for you behind the scenes seven of swords ten of wands Five of coins, ace of wands. Yeah. You might think that what you're doing might break hearts of people, okay? There is a sense of um, hiding and doing what you like doing, and that is becoming very problematic. But 
don't care because this is what gives you happiness so you're not supposed to care so much behind the scenes this is what you're meant to do and that's what is happening for you behind the scenes you're supposed to know this that this is what you're supposed to do all right um hide it do whatever but just make sure that you're doing it and you're not really drifting away from it because that's what you're meant to be and that's what you're meant to do okay don't feel guilty about it don't feel hesitant about it because sometimes i'll tell you what you do something because you want to do it and once you're successful then these same people come back to you saying that um oh my god i am sorry and these are the same people who are going to again come back and say that hey can i be a part of this so please have faith in yourself okay and that is what it's i mean instead of behind the scenes i'm actually picking up a message from the universe for you more of that behind the scenes your success is being knit up through your dreams basically all right so messages that keep following that don't even think about letting go of this all right let's just end the reading with a little advice for you here what is the advice for pile 2 advice for pile 2 five of wands four of swords three of cups don't think so much about what other people are have have to say or if they are bothering you don't let it take a toll on you okay just keep going the way you are you don't have to worry about it have fun allow yourself to enjoy don't think so much all right So that is the message that I'm picking up for you guys pile number 2. I hope this reading brings you clarity and it helps you because my purpose is that only um I shall see you soon again with more readings. Also guys, I have two Instagram pages. You can check them out. The links to each are given in the description box. You can have a look and subscribe I mean follow the one that you're interested in. One is for tarot, the other one is for crystals. So Take care and I shall see you soon. Bye. Okay. So, here we are, pile 3. This is the green aventurine whoever chose this. Let's see what's happening for you behind the scenes. Okay, I have a very happy feeling before opening the cards so i don't know what's happening maybe something really nice let's see improvise dawn watcher caretaker guardian support okay patience your dreams are about to come true pile number 3 if you are if you have a habit of looking to the sky and asking for something that is coming to you but again you just need to improvise on the way you plan things All right. So behind the scenes the universe wants to give you what you want, all right? But maybe the way you're asking it or your approach is a little complicated or maybe you haven't given Oh, I see two 13s here. Interesting. 13 is the death card. A big change coming your way, I guess. And the change is for the good. Like if you've been going through a very very tough time in your life, your life is about to change. okay all you probably need to do is just um write things clearly and visualize things clearly and proceed in that direction because that is what is lacking and that is what you're being asked to improvise upon all right behind the scenes you are getting what you want all right and there is a, some sort of a third eye opening or i'm i'm actually seeing that you're being guided to do something that has always been in your heart okay and if you do it or you already are maybe so it's basically having a clear picture in your mind that this this is what i want to do but maybe you lack the courage or maybe you're just a little scared whether you should do this or not don't feel this way by 3 these thoughts are coming in your mind because you're meant to do this okay 
so here i am seeing all you need to do is improvise a bit because maybe right now your thoughts are a little muddled up you need to just get rid of that that kind of a energy of you know things being all over the place because it's muddled up so yeah if you can manage that then things will definitely become true and behind the scenes that is what you're meant to do behind the scenes this is what is happening for you you getting these thoughts is just not a coincidence okay let's see what's happening behind the scenes some more with the tarot cards four of swords yeah there are some thoughts in your mind which you want to take action and you should take action woo lovely cards here you are not able to sleep because of this dream that you have and it's totally okay because it is meant to give you sleepless nights because this is your passion this is what you meant i think it's a little linked with pile 2 this is what your passion is pile number 2 uh, 3 sorry okay your life will change if you're just able to kind of channelize your thoughts a little more as to this is what i want to do um this can be anything either your love life or your career either of the two anything that you're very passionate about and you're feeling a pull towards something this is what it is behind the scenes you're being called to do something here okay and that's the reason why these thoughts are coming on your mind in your mind and you you should move in this direction all right but before moving have a plan improvise and magician both here so both these cards are just telling me that you got to be on the top of your game you cannot just be playing like throwing stones in the dark no you have to be very strong very cut cut through and very very vigilant clear channelized all these words like your plan has to be ready okay Let's see what's happening for you behind the scenes pile 3 The devil Queen of Cups The sun eight of swords here in the bottom so here pile number 3 what i'm seeing is don't think so much that's the basic message you're not supposed to think so much because this is your calling okay this is what you are supposed to do and this is what is going to bring you the happiness that you've always been seeking you're probably overthinking and stopping yourself you got to declutter your mind a bit okay sometimes i'll tell you as humans we have a tendency of thinking about certain things and you know getting complicated in our mind and that's exactly what's happening here you just need to get rid of that and everything else is fine it's coming for you all right it is coming for you here are the words it's just that you got to have some positive thinking in your mind in your heart and let things happen okay because i'm seeing that the only problem here is that maybe you're not very planned about how you want to approach this situation so for example if this is to do with your love life um maybe you know that yes this is what you want but then again some thoughts some things come in your mind which just complicate your head and then you go again swinging back to another love another direction which is not what you really want So all you're being asked to is to improvise on yourself and have certain things planned out well. Okay? Let's see what is the advice for you from the tarot cards if we pick anything extra for you. Just the advice. 8 of pentacles. King of swords. six of wands i have twice so you got to be patient and keep working if anyone stops you ignore that person you got to be very straightforward about what you want and people who love you have to understand you if they don't you don't bother okay because i had i had heard this saying long time back those who mind don't matter and those who matter don't mind so when they start minding basically you know who matters 
I hope this this is like a riddle, but it's quite meaningful. I mean, it took me a while to understand, but now when I do, I really do. Okay, so that's your reading pile three. I hope this gives you the clarity that you're seeking. And private readings are open, so you can reach out to me. Um, I have two pages on Instagram. One is for tarot, the other one is for crystals. So you can choose the one you're interested in or you can follow both. Uh, I do daily energy check-ins on the tarot page. So in case if you're interested, you can go there as well. I shall see you soon with more readings. Take care and bye.